Hello everybody, this is Roving Shadow, and back for more Quest for Glory. This time we will be heading up the rest of the way of this tree, and oh great, it's this slowdown again. No, <laughs> why? Um, once we finish up here, we will head back into the um, Sambani village quickly, and go into the cave mate Hector don't make me push you off the tree I will oh wow look at this place and there's a tree and a tree as I said last time huh incredible feeling of living energy flows through you as you enter you smell the perfumes of thousands of different flowers all blending together to overwhelm your senses ah it's beautiful in here you hear the sounds of all the living things in here, creating a melody which is so beautiful, you are moved to tears. It's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. It is the music of life itself. The very air invigorates and revitalizes you. You feel as though you've reached this ultimate center of all living things in the universe, and that you are suddenly the source of all energy and life. This place is like, well, totally awesome, dude. I, I love that. I love that ending. Best ending ever. So, it is... It is nice in here. It's very, very... Peaceful and beautiful. So, what we do now is... How many do we have? Oh, we have four. Look at all that. We... Um... Oh. There we go. We pour some of the water from the Pool of Peace here. And we get some lovely music for some reason. Okay, you empty the skin of peace water. A few months later, a new fruit appears on the branch near you. This must be your gift from the heart. Ah, lovely. It looks delicious. Gift from the heart of the world. Okay. Well, now we are done with the tree. I hope you all enjoyed it. Because we will never be here. Ever again. Forever. Never. And ever. Never. And I will stop now. And... Oh, I so wish we could just jump off. And we won't have to go through this slow down... Come on. Come on. Are you serious? Um. So you all don't have to suffer. Let me pause the recording quickly while we go down the stupid tree. Oh, wait, maybe? Maybe you will. One, mi one moment, people. Okay, finally made it down this stupid tree. Ah, I'm glad we're never coming back here. Or else I would get angry. Very angry! Okay, let's leave this area for now. But of course, something has to stop us. Of course. Oh, and it's a stupid, stupid ant. Uh, one second so you don't just see me running. Okay, we're back out here. Hopefully we can make a little bit of distance. But of course not. Oh, maybe this is something new? Okay, it's something new. So we can fight it. I'm okay with fighting it. It's time to prove yourself. The battle begins, yay! And, uh, I forgot to look at it. Oh well. I'm sure we will come across another one at some point. And... Oh, I can't remember if this can poison. If it poisons me, I am going to be angry. But it didn't have a chance. Haha, <laughs> you're dead. Okay. Let's look at it. 
You've heard that rattlesnake meat is very tasty, but you're not at all sure about flying cobras. Um, um, I, you are an idiot. I clicked on the thing, and you've run and grabbed a rock. And I, you're going, you know what, fine, fine. I don't care anymore. I, I, I just don't care. Not at all. Not in the least. Uh, no, no. One second. My goodness, that took forever. I was literally running for like two and a half minutes. Probably closer to three or four even. Oh man. That, that, that was not fun. Ah, yeah, shut up. I am unhappy now. I... Okay. Um... You know, I don't know if it... It might also be this part that glitches, so... Just because I don't want to have to redo some stuff again, I'm going to save quick. And... Then we're going to go talk to the Elder again. Um... Elder... Talk... Stuff. Things. Okay. Come on, hurry up. Finish saving. Come on. Why is everything so slow in this stupid game? Uh, now it's getting... Okay. Better have let me enter. Or else I would have been unhappy. Let's greet. And... Let's talk to him. Um, I, okay, that's the only thing that we have to ask about. Okay, there's a source of all their power. How did he get the drum? One of our bravest warriors was found dead. D-E-D. -E -D, dead. Wait. D-E-D-D. -E -D, D, dead. Duh. <laughs> um, skill by magic. That, that's, that's tragic. That's very tragic and honestly I don't care about the end. No, we do not ask about the drum again. He gets angry or something and we don't want that. So let's say goodbye. Um, okay. If you can find a lot of I'm swinging the prisoner. Yeah, 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 yeah. Honey will have the spin. War will be okay. Goodbye. Um, okay, let's rest in here. Um, no. Oh. Duh. Sleep from here. Sleep till morning. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, we are just gonna do one thing, possibly, if he's up here. And then we will be heading back to Tarna, maybe. Oh, it's only you, Ahura. Um, you're... Okay. You're a good guard. I think that there's much we could learn if Ahura can become a man again. Yes, 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 I know. But uh, come on, I, I want to talk to Yasufu. I want to play a game. It's a fun game. It, I don't care about you. Um... You know, it might just be that it's too early. It might not be around yet. Um, perhaps it'll let me rest for an hour. Maybe now. No. Um, we'll take care of that later then. So for now, it is back into the savanna. And we need to find something. And it's sort of random as to when it shows up. Or we could just get into a fight right here and ah. Oh. Um, you know what? I'm not gonna run for three minutes again. We're fighting this and you all have to sit and watch. Because I am angry. And this ant needs to die in a fire. 
Someone give me a big old magnifying glass. I'll burn it. Come on. Come on, you're dead. Good. Now can we leave? Come on, give me my feet back. Good, you gave me my feet back. Maybe we can get a few more steps. And... Come on. Come on. Show up. Please show up. Should be like right around in this area. Please? No, of course. Oh. God. You know what? I'll cut it here. I'll kill this and then I'll come back. One second. Okay, it's dead. So now, hopefully, should be like right around here. Uh, one second. Okay, well, I um, I beat the thing, and I started just wandering around, so that's why it's night. But I came across this, so let's look at it. Watch out! It's a trap! It's a trap? Nah, it's not a trap. You spring the trap so that it will no longer be a threat. We are good people. That trap is too totally entrenched to take. Um... By any chance... Would it let me sleep here? Peacefully? Until morning. Oh, I think it's gonna let us. Yes! Okay. Um... I will, um cut until I find what I'm looking for, so one minute. Okay, I'm back. Um, I couldn't find what I was looking for. I am wondering if perhaps I have to... Oh, come on. If perhaps I need to talk to someone in Tarna for this to show up. But I thought I already... I don't know. So, we're gonna go to Tarna for now. Even though it's now going back to night. Well, in a second. It'll be night by the time we reach Tarna. Uh, come on. I hate you. I, I, I... Do you know what? Ah... Uh, you're annoying and uh, you know what this game needs it needs repels max repels uh, or a big big shotgun or elephant gun or something or a grenade or a rocket launcher or something so I could like relieve all my stress Oh, come on, good. Yeah, this, uh... Slightly annoying these past few episodes with all these enemies and... Random encounters. It's almost as bad as Pokemon. Almost. At least we're not in a cave. Ah. Okay. Yes, we made it back. Happy days once more. Happy joyous days. So let's head back into turn and let's go back to our room. Sleep. And um, I guess then we can take care of a few things which we will need to do and hey, hey, um oops no we do also have to wait for someone to show up here at some point not quite sure when um I don't know if it's in the evening or in the um morning or just random 
So, possibly at some point we will um, talk to someone. Um, let's see. Um, you are just elderly woman. Uh, okay. No one of important right now. Um, let's see. Let's start here just to, um, oh, okay. Um, is there anything else you're, um, well, that's a lot. <laughs> I was not expecting that much. Um, well, first let's say hello. Let's tell about Julinar, kindness, Julinar, love, fruit, yes, happy days. Incredible, it is. Um, tell about vines. Wow, what an adventure, I know. Let's tell about the guardian. Great cosmic karma cookies. That, that, that is amazing. I, for, I forgot about that. That is great, I have to use that someday. Um. Yes, you should. It is like totally cool. Tell about the gift. What goes around comes around. A field of dreams. Yep, full of peace. Oh. Oh, so. Yeah. Arana. So that was. Yeah. Okay, I was incorrect with what I said before about... Or did I actually say? I thought this game didn't have like an actual like Arana's Peace Guard or whatever. I guess I was wrong. I guess that is sort of Arana's area. Um, oh, not, not that. I wanted to talk to you. Um, let me just go through don't need to read all this. It's all pointless, useless, and um, okay, we might, it might have been that we didn't ask about this. Yep, I'm willing to bet this is why what I was looking for did not show up, because I am an idiot. Um, okay, got most of this stuff, yeah, 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 yeah. Made water from pool of peace. We've got gift from the heart of the world. We've got that. Fruit of venom is fine. We've also got that. Oh, actually, it wasn't that one that we needed to talk about. It was pills. Um, which one? Yeah, we've got everything there that we needed. There we go. This one, feathers. There. Ask about feather. To make healing pills, I need the feather of a honey bird. Which is what I've been looking for. The happier the honey bird, the more effective. If the feather is from an ex-avian, the pill is a dud. Need to get it non-violently. Okay. Um, that's... That should do it And Oh. I didn't mean to leave. I forgot. I have all the stuff for the Dispel Potion. <laughs> and I might as well give it to him now. Um, it seems like days since we were last here. We walked out of the front door, we turned around, and we came back. That seemed like days. Great, this piece of water will really mellow the potion. Yes, it will. So now we will give you something to demellow it. Gee, you got this stuff. Hope you didn't get hurt. No, no, no. Not at all. Um... So now, what am I looking for? Um, uh, uh, that's what I'm looking for. Okay, can I make some truly strong potions with this stuff? Very good. Um, okay, so some other day we can get the Dispel Potion. Okay, so now... Um, yeah, let's head up here. And go into the temple that we were kicked out of before. 
Okay, we have returned and we have what you asked for. You hear a deep voice echoing in your head. Releaser of Darkness has returned. Yes, we have. I feel that. Okay, has, has the doom. Hey, hey, we are not doom. But yes, we have brought the gem. Does it? Yes, yes, we do. Get a female voice once more, then he shall be judged. I hope I'm judged honorably, because that would be bad. Okay. And. Come on. Drink now. Uh, is this safe to drink? I, I don't trust this. I have a bad feeling about this. Yep, I had a bad feeling about that. You just drugged us. Whoa, this is great stuff. You feel yourself floating, bodiless, in this strange place. It's like awesome. A deep, strange voice speaks. Choose that which you are. Well, we have a heart, a key, an ankh, or however you say it. A pentagram, a sword, and a cup. I probably didn't need to actually look at those, but that's okay. So we choose a heart because we love everybody. We're a paladin. You are finally alone with the woman of your dreams. Before you can ask her to marry you, she tells you she is in love with your best friend. What do you do? <gasps> How could she? Oh, now we have choices, and some of these are interesting, others are not. I don't know how these choices are. Try to convince her that you will make a much better husband than your friend, and that she should marry you. Well, you could do that. Out of your great love for her, you wish her happiness with her chosen husband, and hope to remain friends with both of them. Tell her what a rotten, stinking, no good for nothing louse your best friend is. Then tell her how much better you are and ask her to marry you. Look deeply within your soul and decide which is more important to you. The love of this woman or the enduring friendship of your best pal. Figuring that anyone who wants your best friend for a husband has got to be a real twinkie. You go off looking for another chick. No, that's bad. Um, do we look deeply within our soul? Or should we just wish her the best and be friends with both of them? Um, hmm. Which one? Which one? Um, well, let's, let's go with number two. That seems like a good one. Choose that which you are. Okay, um, we have an hourglass, a key, a ring, a yin yang, an infinity symbol, and a raised fist. Um, hmm, I think I'll go with the yin yang. I like the yin yang. Hear the voice again. You are called to a distant city to act as an impartial judge on a murder trial. When you arrive, you discover that the accused is an old friend from your childhood. What do you do? Tell the magistrate of the town you cannot be a judge since you know the defendant. Take the position as judge so that you can help your friend now that he most needs you. Admit to the town magistrate that you are a friend of the accused and let him determine whether you should be the judge or not. Accept the position of the judge so that you can make certain that your friend gets an honest trial. And a rigged one for him, and, uh, uh, and that true justice may be done. Accept the position as judge so you can get even with your former best friend for marrying the girl of your dreams. <laughs> I love that. Um... Well, we will, we will admit that we know him and see if we should still be a judge or not. Okay, um, hmm. 
That's just a candle. Huh. Which one? Which one should we be? Um. A light in the darkness. Let's be the candle. Darkness surrounds three burning candles. Engraved in the stone floor are the words, you must choose one. The yellow candle burns the brightest, the green candle burns the steadiest, and the brown candle burns dim, but long. Which do you choose? Hmm. Let's see. We could take yellow, green, brown, red. Or decline and accept the darkness. Um, wait, let me see. Which ones were which? Um, yeah, I didn't think there was a red one. I was like, wait. Yeah, yeah. Engraved in the stone are the words. Yeah, there's three burning candles. Yeah. So, no. And the green one was the steadiest. So, I. I think I will go with that one, because we don't want to accept the darkness. I mean, it would be nice to have a bright one, but it's not going to last long. And I mean, brown one, it's going to last a while, but it's so dim that it's not really going to be that useful. So the green one, it's got a nice steady flame. We will go with the green candle. Thy soul has been weighed. Thou hast chosen thine own path, and by that path you shall be judged. The first is that which was. The heart is the life, the blood, the soul of truth. It is the center of emotion, and the dance of the universe. With the heart within, compassion and understanding fill you. The second is that which is. The yin-yang is the union of opposites. The balance of the universe, it is male and female, dark and light. You wrestle with your soul to attain this balance while you deal with a world of opposition. The third is that which will be. The candle is the flame of life. You desire glory like a moth. You are drawn to the candle and may be consumed by its brilliance. Yet the threat of death does not deter you and you will do what you can to attain greatness. You are one with yourself and shall be what you have been. Your skills are in harmony with your nature. By your actions, you have shown yourself to be compassionate and considerate of others. You are judged worthy. All right, we're judged worthy. Thou hast unleashed the darkness and the darkness now encircles thee. You must walk a narrow path to bring back the light. Let the first part of thy path be guided by friendship. Thy feet already walk upon this path. Two thou hast known before, three thou shalt free. One thou hast brought low, then help to rise again. One shall stand thy rival and thy friend. The sword shall cross thy path, and bonds shall be cut asunder. Seek thou the least of guides, and lead thee to the depths of darkness. Now thou art opener of the way, and all thy heart has called shall draw near to thee. Two shall stand, and five shall follow, to face their greatest foe in a battle they cannot win. For thou must walk alone to free them all. Seek ye now the highest tower to find the door of darkness. Living stone shall block thy way, then bridge thee to thy foe. Thou must lose thy greatest treasure, ere thou canst drive the darkness through the door. This is that which might yet be. Thy path is thine own to follow or not. Go forth now, bringer of the light. And wow, that was... That was deep, that was interesting. You awaken to find yourself in your room. Yeah, I think we had a little too much of that, uh... Whatever that drink was. Whatever they spiked it with. But... Okay. 
Well, that was a very, very interesting conversation um, thing. <laughs> um, and again, we're running a little long on the video time, so as I keep just walking in circles, I suppose this is a good spot to um, end the video. And next time, we should be able to get pretty much everything done here in um, Tarna. Probably head back to the village, the Simbani village, and um, go from there. So, I will see you all next time.